Hello there, this is Space Runner 5. Welcome back to episode 3 of our Gotland Let's Play series, where last episode we took over a little bit more of Den Denmark, and then we also got the Teutons as a vassal since Poland did go ahead and attack them after we did, so we at least got a single province uh, to build off, because, well, eventually we're going to try and do a reconquest for all of their cores. Why did you lose your core in province? Did they Polish really revoke your core there? It's technically Polish. They did revoke your core. That's very unfortunate. Oh well. One less core for us to get. Not too bad. Uh, you're fighting Norway. I'm also, like, privateering you. You've almost completely consolidated Ireland as well already. That's super fast. I'll take five book tradition. Thank you. Uh, uh, France, why did you not uh, take more land off of England? Interesting. I guess you had the mains event. Why haven't you attacked England yet is also a question. I bring wedding already fired. Naples is still fear. Austria, like, the AI is being super... Oh, look at that. The Ottomans already took a huge chunk out of Crimea as well. Dang. Dang, Muscovy is already almost consulted. They definitely did a lot of AI improvements. Dang, is all I'm thinking. Ooh. Port independence of whom? Geneva? I'm not interested. Extra diplomat? Uh, not required right now. Uh, where are my boats? Uh, let me give me one boat. Actually, I don't have Diplotex 6 anyway, so I can't take it. We're almost there. Uh, go sacrificial cog. I'm just going to steal maps from Portugal. It's all good. So we want to go ahead and find uh, Bermuda real quick and give us give ourselves a, a free little colony. Um, you're out there. I mean, you're just you're just going to have to stay, sit out there until we get tech. There we go. All right, Portugal. Get Northwest Atlantic. Okay. It does not give me a Bermuda, though. Just, uh, oh, you're suffering a lot of attrition. Come on home. No need to sacrifice yourself today. Uh, you're privateering. These are other uh, transports. We got fat stacks of dough. Definitely like having that for sure. Also, this didn't get upgraded because probably because I didn't own it. So we actually have to own those provinces uh, when we take the click like we did last time. It was a learning experience. It's all good. Go. go ahead and give us those two extra centers of trade for additional dosh here. There we go. Five, almost five ducats there earned. Our economy is doing much better. You guys are repairing. Very good. Oh, we got caught spying on Portugal again. That's unfortunate. Let's see. Do I just statify this stuff? Who are you friends with? England. I definitely can't fight England and Poland uh, together or separately. Uh, you're too strong. You're too strong. What do you got? Uh, keep Eric. Sure. Um, give me a mercantilism instead. That's way better. You're only allied to Riga. Are you seriously part of the Empire too? What garbage is this? I can't fight the Austria. I more boats to them, but I don't have 35,000 troops worth. Uh, can I get cannon? I can indeed get the value cannon. There we go. Fill up to our forest limit once more. You guys go ahead and drill. We'll just slowly build ourselves up. Sweden, you have two good allies. Two good of allies. Already down my rating. England's got some boats. Trader died. Oh, that sucks. Uh, give me another one. I think another one is uh, pretty good. Their blow up doesn't matter. Yearly Republican tradition, plus 0.2. That just seems pretty good, because you, you also get the improved uh, relations, which gives us a reduction, uh, which is phenomenal. Ooh, uh, I need to join the Empire so I can go eat these two fools without you intervening. In 181 relations. I mean, that's not impossible, it just, I can't ally you, though. Cannot ally countries that have not hoisted the black flag. Very unfortunate. Very unfortunate indeed. So we'll have to go kill uh, kill Austria. Because we were uh, a little early. Uh, we definitely want uh, the these guys to be in charge. The bureaucrats. Who do we currently have? These guys? Uh, it's not the worst thing in the world, but I definitely want the bureaucrats. Uh, for the additional Republican tradition. That's not worth. Uh, is that worth it? What's the trade goods? 
Oh, I, I definitely want that. Ish. Anchors. Oh, iron. Uh, except it's got no production. I come back from there. Let's see, who hates Poland? Bohemia. Uh, I would like a Bohemian, except I still can't ally them. Like, <laughs> I'd love to make an alliance, but uh, that's not a thing. We don't know what those are. Uh -uh. Which is interesting. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll take that. I think we can go a military idea. What makes sense? To, I mean, Plutocratic is just kind of a, a generalist. It's pretty good. Um, but I don't... The caravan power is okay. It's not quite what I'm looking for in terms of trade. That was a very quick truth with the two tons thinking about that. Uh, regionalism, maximum of cultures, promote culture speed, doesn't matter. Governing capacity is good for us. Yeah, just... Wait. Global prosperity growth. No, I don't care about that. Uh, give me the governing capacity. Staple controller, congratulations. Austria is no longer a great power. Really, you're not a great power, even though you have a PU on Hungary? Give your PU on... No, you don't have your PU on Bohemia. Okay. Diplotic or extra diplomat. I don't know. Not sure yet. Or we can go for an admin idea. We can technically do that right now. You only cancel military access again. That's fine. I don't really feel the need to go down mercs um because we have plenty of manpower like it's, that's not an issue for us innovative question mark three policies plus one Is that each or just one policy for free or exhaustion like i only want the first three about it uh yeah i'm down to lose 38 ducats that's no problem we go exploration actually Actually, that's technically expansion, because we can just steal maps from Portugal. Wherever they go, we just go to. That could be a thing. Because that gives us colonists, merchants, diplomatic relations, which doesn't matter. Center of trade upgrade cost reduction. Global trade power. I'm actually inclined to do this. Expansionist is pretty solid. How does it pair with espionage, though? Because I would like some synergy, at least. Monthly autonomy change reduction, foreign spy detection. I mean, it doesn't. That's not good. That would just purely be for the ideas. Caribbean Sea? 37. I have found a Bermuda. But not really. <laughs> I just know the island is there. Uh, so we're gonna... Oh, yeah. I understand you're suffering attrition. Uh... Sail back as fast as feasibly possible. I would like 15 prestige, thank you. I appreciate that. Austria learned seven provinces from Poland. Okay. Maybe we do go, uh, expansionist. Be okay with that, because we'll, we'll have our colony, um, over in, uh, Bermuda to be able to build off of. That should be fine. Uh, give me a year reduction, because we already killed uh, Denmark to take Norway off them. So we were a little slow there, because I wasn't paying too much attention to our splendor. Because I never do. Uh, we need another level 2 or higher. Oh, I just need to upgrade one. Give me 11 points. Present on two continents. Humility rival and a peace deal. Fortunately, all my rivals are pretty much dead. We killed them all. Uh, my only available rival is Sweden. Awesome. Perfect. Still in the Empire? Of course you are. Uh, and Austria's just gonna walk up here and kick our butts is the answer to that. So, not quite what I want to do. Why are we losing money is also a great question. It's with Norway and Hamburg. I don't think I have any claims on Norway, actually, thinking about that. I don't. That's actually something we should probably need. Pick up two or spy detection. The yearly corruption. I don't even care about corruption. Heck, I'm just gonna go ahead and click that button. Uh, don't even bother funding for it. Uh, I'll just go away. Um, I do think we go ahead and statify this then. Uh, I'll keep them again. Might as well. I don't really see a reason not to do this. It'll reduce our overall autonomy and provinces give us government reform progress faster. So that seems fine. 
Um, you're chilling. You're only allied to Riga, which is very unfortunate that you end up joining the Empire. Otherwise, I would have eaten, eaten you, devoured you, if you will. Poland. 100,000 troops. Rebel support efficiency, plus 15%. That is via the espionage ideas. Hmm. Not quite what I'm looking for. Oh, oh well. Uh, this is colonists. Yes. Uh, we are gonna go for. For global settler increase. That's fine. We go to all overall, and then one of these map modes is actually for colonizing. I always forget because I almost never colonize because I hate colonizing. <laughs> it's super boring, but we'll do it this time. Excuse me. Um, I don't think I have any colonial range. i uh, thinking about that, but hey. What's that claim on? Norway. This province technically would have been a little bit better, but also not a big deal. Uh, they also don't have any troops, so... You guys go park your butts there. We're gonna go kill eat all of Norway. Should be fine. Uh, do I want East Frisia as well? I don't think they're a center of trade. Well, they do have an estuary, so that I, I am gonna go eat East Frisia is the answer to that. Uh, I don't see any issues with that at the moment. This is military tech ahead of time. Okay. They only have 10,000 men total. Thank you. Give me the calf. Should we go do the battle first, and then we'll go from there. Uh, calf goes there. Stay there. And go forward. I don't think you need to fight at all, though. But there. And we're good to go. Oh, you actually just straight up just stack wave their army. Okay. Well, we're going to go annex all of Norway. Call it good. East Frisia is not an issue. Lose 10 prestige. Give me the papal influence. Thank you. Horse peace from Poland. Why do you want to intervene? Why are you enforcing peace is also a great question. Do I think I can fight a Poland? No, no, I don't. Am I gonna try? Probably. Uh, cause that's already occupied. I don't particularly care about that. I also ignored them. They are indeed in the war now. Okay. And they're gonna get military access through Sweden. So, all right. So this will this will be an interesting uh, endeavor. I don't know why they decided to enforce peace on us. I haven't done anything. Where's also my navy? Over there. I don't want them getting on my capital. Although we could systematically destroy their, their armies that way. Hi, right, Norway. Don't mind us. Ship durability increase. Very nice. Appreciate that a lot. Go all the way over there. East Frisia, you're standing there. We're blockading here, so you guys can't get across anyways. Hopefully all the enemies of Poland go ahead and decide to give us fat stacks of money. Um... And Poland's just going to end up getting pieced out uh, here. We're going to blockade their coast and call it good. There we go. Say goodbye to your army, East Frisia. Nice. Lost a thousand troops. All right, you guys go dock up over here. This navy is going to come over here to blockade Poland. There you go. Now you get war exhaustion. I also get war exhaustion, a bunch of devastation here, but I'm going to build a fort here, so it won't be an issue. Uh, we can go ahead and defund the army. Army doesn't matter anymore. There we go. Right now we're just losing money uh, due to people take, stealing stuff from our cities. Uh, why is this so low? Occupation of all those provinces is worth quite a bit. Danzig is occupied by Poland, minus 28%. I see. Well, we're just going to have to chill. Eventually we'll get the modifier for making gains. But yeah, we're just gonna chill for a while. Could take the mother tech, that is something we could do. Privateering efficiency, chance to capture enemy ships. Very nice, I appreciate that. Fortunately, your boats are inside a fort. I can't do much about that. 
Should I try and combat the growth of Devastation right now? It's 0.2 per month. I'm going to swap you over to... Nope, don't have the uh, the state edict for uh, Devastation. Okay. Pick that up because the yearly tick just went by because I would like some tact or uh, some innovativeness. You guys are nice and safe there. I mean, this is just going to keep ticking up. We're, we're totally fine. We're, we're going to go up to speed five. We're just going to get Devastation out, out the butt over here. That's okay. We're going to build a fort over there anyways. Uh, you allied? No, your England's going to conquer you. I uh, will take the prestige for 40 years. Sure, do that. Hopefully East Frisia leaves this boat alone. <laughs> Just go! Uh, actually, which colonial region is this in? I need to know what where this guy is. Uh, West Bermuda, Bermuda Sea. I don't know where it is. Get in there. Over there. I'm going to stand next to it. Took a loan for 67 decks. Yeah, that's fine. Be fun. Wait, what is our big expense here? Interest for loans. Fleet. That's oh, mostly our fleet maintenance, actually. I mean, yeah, we're, we're a little over. A little bit. Got lots of light ships, though. Got lots of those. I only need one. One is enough. As long as uh, East Frisia's navy stays all the way over there, I'm I'm fine. We're okay. Oh, actually, my boat. Is, oh no. There we go. The oh, it's Caribbean. Okay, so give me Caribbean. Uh, we we found Bermuda. Permanent claim, yeah, give me that. It's too far away for me to send my colonist. <laughs> well, you guys go ahead and dock up there. You'll be safe. It's too far away, my butt. Uh, fortunately, there are no rebels there, uh, or no natives there to try and kick us off. So, there you go. We're already starting to colonize. Look at us go. Uh, I also don't need that anymore. Might as well... Uh, doesn't like you. Muscovy and Bohemian. Does, do either one of you want to intervene in my war? Poland intervened in this war and I, I didn't even want them coming. Um, give me the bureaucrats. That's fine. Uh, we need our Republican tradition to come back anyway, so. Chill. Foreign spy detection, minus 20%. Good thing that doesn't matter. Uh, prove with you. I'm assuming I cannot join the HRE anymore. Too big. That's only 183. I just need more opinion. So you guys are just sitting there. Unfortunately, you're not suffering any attrition. Uh, I lose stab. Sure, pick up defensiveness, I guess. Can't say it matters. Going out. Minus 73. War score. Military strength. Length of war. Ally and war. Yup. Hungary got a new cardinal. Congratulations. Port defensiveness. Sure. We be chilling. Uh, what is our war exhaustion? Ours is going up. Point one. Poland's isn't really going up. Oh sure, yeah, I'll take another cardinal. Ours is going up faster than Poland's is. Poland's at zero actually. They just buy it down. No, it's not even going up. I see. Uh, I see how it is. Well, we could try and trap them on one of these islands. Um, but once they actually physically occupy it, we're kind of, kind of done so. Oh, Norway's occupied though. All right, two percent war score. And I, I, I only want your full annexation. Only thirteen point five AE for all that. Oh, well, that's interesting. Teutons have rebels for what? Teuton peasants. Well, if they reoccupy that, we get twenty-eight uh, percent war score. So that should uh. I'll sway this a little bit for... I think the war is going to start trending in our favor. This is... I mean, we're pretty much almost capped. Diplo rep reduction uh, does not make a difference to me whatsoever. So we're blockading here. Why don't we go ahead and sit you there, because I forgot about you. Oh, it's time to raid again. Sure, we'll go raiding. Right there as well. I, I took some loans, so I, I definitely want to uh, start repaying them. 
this timer get reduced? Because it seems a lot quicker. Go. Let me just park our butts over here. Thank you for the money there, Sweden. 77 ducats there. 17 there, not too much. I'm really looking forward to the English area. That sounds pretty nice. I've already occupied all that, so that's fine. 77 ducats there. Oh, yeah. 163 ducats there. You guys are paying for me. Thank you for the 75 there, England. 59 there. 16 is probably like 8 here or something. Not oh, 30 ducks. That's more than I thought. Half a ducat here. Not 6. Not too bad. Nice. Alright, you guys can go back to... Why don't we protect trade inside the Lubeck node? Uh, just prevent them from doing anything uh, fancy over there. Okay, we got our fat stacks of money. Go and repair loans. Uh, you guys go ahead and drill. I'll pay for that. Yeah, plenty of money. Still have all of our advisors. <clears throat> an additional merchant? Oh, yes, I will gladly take an additional merchant. What am I going to do with this guy? Uh, we can transfer here, technically, to there, which isn't that great. <clears throat> uh, we earn 0.83. I probably want to transfer here, uh, over here. Yeah, give us additional 3%. That's much better. Go. Oh, we just got the conquest seat behind and you. Hmm, Portugal still defend you, but hey. I have a colony, so I'm good. I'm happy and content. Uh, an up-and-coming pirate. Sure. Look at that guy. Bureaucrats back in charge for Republican tradition. Yearly corruption reduction. Oh man, dude, we our corruption just falls away. 0.27 per month reduced? Poland, are, are, are you sure you still want to be in this war? I think the war is starting to tick away. It, it, it's a little devastating for us, I know. Our devastation's a little high here now. It's in the 20s. Yeah, that's gonna suck. Alright, so you're capped out. We can get another 25 opinion if we were to go ahead and scornfully insult your rival. That would get us up to 150 means I basically just need an event uh, to fire. Monthly favor growth. That's actually pretty nice, too. Granted, I don't have any allies, so it's actually slightly better if you're uh, not a Pirate Republic, but hey. Let's try it out. Um, lose four wargs. Nah, dude, I don't care if you have rebels. They're peasants, like... Wasn't this supposed to fire earlier? No, I'll take prestige, thank you. Uh, boat. Wish to steal maps again. Uh, I would like the North Atlantic. American South America. No, I want the North. Mississippi? I mean, I could definitely be persuaded for the Mississippi. I take South America. No, I want the American East Coast. No units in the region. Excuse me, I have a singular boat there. There we go. Thank you for 21 new provinces. I appreciate it. Also gonna go just 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 adjacent. Don't mind me. Uh, we're gonna steal some more maps. Yeah, maps. Uh, I would like the uh, the American East Coast. That's a bay? Sure. Oh, that's that area. Not not quite what I was looking for, but I appreciate. Go and dock back up. Thank you, Portugal, for uh spending all this time and energy to get over there. Natural scientists passed away. That's okay. Dab cost. Eh, do I have unrest? Not really. Yeah, I don't I don't have unrest. Uh we can go for stab cost, because I'll probably want to stab up here, maybe. Where there is maybe. You want out yet? I minus 26 war score due to occupation of Danzig, which I don't care about. Uh, where'd your guys' armies go? If you're gonna let me reoccupy this, I will. Engineer, military engineer died. Okay, it's fine. Ah! 
There's a Polish army. Run! Lee! Yeah, I, that's what I thought. I just wanted to bring you back, though. Poland's at two. I'm gonna eat this guy, though. No, you can stay. Poland, we've waited so long for you to... I don't know why you decided to join this war. It's a lost cause to begin with. Actually, I don't think I eat East Frisia. I just want to get all of this unoccupied. Poland! Stop! <laughs> Why do you do this? Uh, give me a new guy. New guy. Uh, reinforce speed. No, dude, you're on zero. I'm not gonna accept that. Uh, there you go. You say no. Uh, I'll accept that. Okay. Peace, someone on out. Poland. Look, dude. I have the ticking war goal. I can wait for peasants to rise up there and be fine. Can I colonize here now? Yeah, there we go. Now we can go ahead and colonize. Uh, let's see. Centers of trade. I have a claim on this. I can only... Apparently I cannot colonize very far. Can I colonize here? No, it's part of the Caribbeans already. Okay, that's seven development. I'll colonize there. No, I'm not gonna ex or expel any minorities. I don't think that's a good mechanic, so. Will not be a thing. What do you want? I'm not giving you that, though. Like, screw you! No, uh, we also have, like, rebels inside Denmark now at this point. I guess we gotta go help them. Lots of rebels inside Denmark, okay. Uh, that's gonna cost us the ticking wargle, which kind of sucks. What do you want? Uh, I'm, I'm still gonna say no, like... Ugh, that hurt. That hurt a lot. Poland's like, oh, th he no longer is winning the war. Uh, no, the answer is I'm still winning the war. I just lost that for a second. Lost the conquest. Oh yeah, that's because I went to your colonial nation. That's fine. Not a problem. Oh, they walked back over into Sweden. Very nice. Nobody wants white peace. No. I've I'm invested in this war. I have, that's capped. Uh lose ten ducats? Sure, lose ten ducats. Not a problem. I'm here. Like <laughs> uh, that occupation. We'll walk over here real quick. We'll take both of those. Nobody wants white peace. No is the answer. Uh, I guess the higher dev colonies is actually pretty good right now. Is this all one province? Oh, it is. It's just a really big province. Okay. Go and park your best down there. Alrighty, Poland. Minus 24. I really wish that you had just surrendered. I have no way to really fight your army. Uh, can I build? Oh, I can build another 2,000 troops. Gets us up to 18,000. Not really enough to fight you guys. You have 28,000. Extra gold settlers is nice. Let's go ahead and build those guys up. What do you got here? Gain church on the Turk Islands. Turks Islands. I have no idea where this province is. Um, sure, give me a church. I'm assuming it's on my land. Um, piss off, Riga. It's my trade power. I'm good with that. So we made it home. I may let them in just for a second. What do you got here? You got a 1-2. What do we got here? For one, I would like someone better. I mean, he's a little bit better. Uh, actually, you guys just dock up for a second. Come on in, Poland. Um, yes, go straight to that fort. That is a great option. Seventh, seventh. Stop bugging out. 
fourth, so I need to wait three more days. I'll say hi there. All right, Bolin. I, ju I just killed some of your troops. Minus 24. Okay. I think we go a little bit over our force limit with these 2,000 additional troops. I think he'll be useful. Uh, Yeah, I mean, this will just just free land, basically. Only three development, though. Loose stat. That sucks. Wasn't even for a faction takeover or anything. Alrighty, so we are slightly too many leaders, okay. That guy, don't need him. Building additional troops. This will allow us to crush the uh, the, poor, the Polish, and hopefully it'll be a stack wipe. We have a 2-1 versus a 1-2. He's slightly better than us, even. Alright, he's the best guy. Uh, don't even bother with that. Uh, don't even click it. For that guy. For that guy. I'll be one over because I'll get power projection here. Oh my god, they crushed our army. What happened? They just rolled really well, apparently. Get out of there. Their cavalry hit hard. And hit hard they did. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't expecting them to crush us like that. Uh, but okay. They are sitting on our capital, which is unfortunate. Uh, you guys just reinforce. They're going to suffer attrition for a little bit. Let's go ahead and grab the defensive edict for a little while, just to help. Uh, you guys are fighting there. That seems appropriate. Lose 20 ducats. That's fine. They're suffering attrition. This transport boat can get, make its way all the way back home. No, do not do that. that. That sounds like social suicide right there. Uh, this is Diplo check. Yeah, we'll take that. Minus 24. It's not getting any better. Is the answer. You have too much cav. Um, that was a... We're gonna do that. I just need more than one shock pip. There we go, finally, we got someone. I don't know, like, our army tradition isn't good, I get that, but... Three shocks should not be that hard. Like, I got I got a leader with two siege. I have actually multiple leaders with two siege. Um, I should be able to get better leaders than what we just got. This guy's trash for now. Ugh. Get that guy. That guy's a direct upgrade. There you go. That was so much army or manpower right there, or uh, mil military monarch points right there. Just gone. Do I trade a two tons? I don't think I traded two tons. No, get out of here. Oh, you just wanted to pay a hundred ducats instead. That's fine. No, you still ate it. It did not say seed province. I looked, but oh well, it's over. I'll get the two tons later. That sucked a lot. That hurt. Uh, well, we know we can. We the the Polish army is just strong. Is is just stupidly good. Uh, Norway doesn't exist anymore though. So I mean, it's a thing. Uh, we're gonna statify everything eventually. I just need our war exhaustion. Everything just needs to decay a little bit. Is it time for raiding? I could I could deal with some money, yeah. I'm gonna go raiding over there. I don't know who we're raiding there, but okay. Yeah, it's not time. It's not time. <laughs> that 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 was a. Uh... Oh, it was the Turk Islands all the way over here. Oh, I see. Sure, you guys got a temple. Very nice. Uh, can I build a single infantry? No. Alrighty. Well. That's all the time that I had for today. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you guys please like and subscribe. Have a wonderful day.